This is real Chinese kung fu. Because the video he shot himself underwent post-production speed-up editing. You already know their tricks? I think they're all fake. Big news in the world of Chinese kung fu this past month. What's the big news? There's been a viral spread on the Chinese internet about an expose of the inch punch brick break scam. This has sparked a lot of online discussion about the authenticity of the inch punch brick break. Before we delve into this incident, let's first explain what the inch punch is. Oh, I know this one. Allow me to introduce the inch punch. The inch punch is an advanced martial arts technique invented by Bruce Lee. This martial art can generate force from a very short distance. And the force it generates is several times stronger than normal. Because this method of exertion utilizes the simultaneous rotation of six joints throughout the body. It concentrates the entire body's strength into a single point for an explosive release. Imagine. This explosive force can destroy any enemy. It's simply invincible. Can we not bring movie settings into this, please? First of all, the inch punch is not a martial art. It's a method of exerting force at a short distance. Secondly, the real inch punch is not as powerful as you think. So, you're saying the inch punch is useless? The inch punch has some uses, but it's only applicable in situations requiring short distance exertion. There have been dedicated programs that have conducted tests. The force of an inch punch is only equivalent to 50% to 70% of a normal punch. How is that possible? Haven't you seen the performances of so many inch punch masters on TikTok? As soon as they exert the inch punch, no matter how many bricks there are, they can easily be shattered. This is the incident we're discussing today, the inch punch brick break expose. A month ago, there was a young man named Miaofeng on the Chinese internet. He posted a video claiming that all the videos of inch punch breaking bricks on TikTok are fake. And moreover, he stated that he wanted to challenge all the inch punch masters to a bet. He said that if any master could perform the brick breaking in front of him with the bricks he prepared, he would admit defeat and give that master 500,000 renminbi as an apology. So arrogant. This young man clearly underestimates the power of Chinese kung fu. His actions have undoubtedly offended all the masters who break bricks on TikTok. Because brick breaking has become a category of internet celebrities on TikTok. These brick-breaking internet celebrities have made a fortune from their performances. Even on YouTube, brick-breaking is a popular highlight of Chinese Kung Fu. I believe there will soon be a real master who will show him the power of Chinese Kung Fu. Yes, at this time, a master named Man Lu stepped forward to accept the challenge. Go for it! Let's first take a look at this master's performance on TikTok. Wow, that's amazing, this is real Chinese Kung Fu! So, this, Master Man Lu Lu confidently approached Miao Feng. Unfortunately, his confidence was not based on his real kung fu skills. But on his belief that this young man must be poor and couldn't possibly afford to bet 500,000 renminbi with him. To his embarrassment, the young man really did have 500,000. And he brought out the bricks for him to verify his kung fu on the spot. With no other choice, the master had to grit his teeth and start breaking bricks. So, you're saying this master doesn't have real kung fu skills? Let's take a look at this master's real performance. Why does it feel like the power of the punch is so much less? Because the video he shot himself underwent post-production speed-up editing. So it looks like the punch is faster than a bullet. In his own video, his punch's explosive power is comparable to Superman and the Hulk. So, he's just a weakling? It looks like he failed several punches? Yes, in fact, he injured his hand with the first punch. He tried a few more punches afterwards, but he couldn't bear it, so he had to give up. Because this incident was live-streamed on the internet, he announced the next day that he would quit TikTok. He's not a master at all. He's a fraud. This incident has caused a stir on the internet. Netizens have expressed their hope that other brick-breaking masters will also come forward to verify whether their kung fu is real. Yes, I also want to know if their kung fu is real. Next, let me introduce a few professional brick-breaking athletes who are still active on TikTok. 
First up is a master named Lone Wolf. Look at his hands, there are thick calluses on his fists. That's amazing, it shows that he has broken countless bricks. He must be a real inch punch master, right? Just now, Master Man Lu a broke his hand and couldn't break three bricks. But as you can see, this master broke five in one go. That's fantastic, this is Chinese Kung Fu. Didn't you notice the similarities between his video and Master Man Lu's? You mean, he's also a fake? Let's look at another master, this one is even more of a heavyweight guest. His name is Chi Long. He's a world-class master who has reportedly garnered billions of views on YouTube. Wow. He's all muscle. He must be the real deal in Chinese Kung Fu. All right, let's take a look at his performance. With those muscles, that strength, he can't possibly be fake, right? Haven't you noticed the similarities in their videos yet? It seems like their videos have all been sped up. Not just sped up, they've removed the video frames of the moment their fists make contact with the bricks. Frame removal in videos? Yes, that's correct. Now let's take a look at this master who is known as the number one brick breaker on TikTok. His name is Hunter, and it's rumored online that he's a retired Special Forces soldier. Special Forces. He must be a real expert. His performance is pretty much the same as the previous masters, and the video has also been processed. Is that old man his master? I suppose his master must also be a famous master, right? This a master? He's not famous, and his name is unknown. Why? Shouldn't his master be even more powerful? I'd rather call this old man an actor. Let's take a look at something even more explosive. The recently emerging brick-breaking master is actually her. She is called Inch Punch Girl. I don't know if she really knows how to break bricks, but I'm sure she's proficient in internet traffic. The combination of a Chinese kung fu and beautiful girl, it's hard not to be popular. This must be fake, right? Her arms are so thin, can she break a brick? But the way this female knight breaks bricks is almost the same as the previous master. Do you feel her master looks familiar? Isn't this the master of the special forces soldier we just saw? Could they be from the same team? This girl's performance is too fake. It feels like the brick shattered as soon as it was touched, right? Or has she really mastered the mysterious qigong of Chinese kung fu? If she really has such great strength, her boyfriend would be in danger. It would be troublesome if she got angry and twisted her boyfriend's head off. This girl must be fake, the muscular men before should be real. Really? I think they're all fake. Impossible, there must be one or two real ones, right? Now I'm going to reveal the trickery of these so-called masters. To let you know why I say they're all fake. You already know their tricks? Yes, everyone can become a brick-breaking master following my method. The first method is to buy prop bricks used for filming online. You can buy them by searching on online shopping platforms. About 0.5 US dollars each, they look the same as real bricks. But they are actually made of foam inside, very light, even a six-year-old child can break them. But this method has a drawback. That is, if the camera zooms in, you can still see some differences from real bricks. I also noticed that the texture seems different from real bricks. And there's no brick dust. Yes, you will find that the Ginch Punch Girl used a lot of these fake bricks. But the more professional masters we saw earlier usually don't use this method. They will use the second method using real bricks, but pre-treated. There are actually many specifications of bricks, first choose some of poor quality. Then corrode them with acid, expose them to the sun, heat them, all kinds of methods can make the brick very fragile. For example, the method demonstrated by the young man in Miao Feng first hit these bricks with a hammer. It seems that these bricks are not broken on the surface, but the internal structure has already broken. Finally, just push it lightly, and the brick will break into two sections. This method, it's hard to tell the truth in the video, right? Yes, but there are still flaws. What flaws? Because this brick has already broken in advance. So you will find in the video that the fracture surfaces of these bricks are very flat when they are broken. These fracture surfaces are almost perpendicular to the surface. 
and they will evenly break into two halves of the same size. Normally when you break something, the fragments are usually of different sizes, and the fracture surfaces are irregular. <laughs> it seems to make sense. Let me explain why all the videos need to be accelerated and frame dropped. Because the brick has been pre-treated, there will be a feeling of cracking at the moment it is broken. In order to make the audience feel as if the brick is being flown by the impact, you need to accelerate the moment of the shot and delete the few frames when the brick cracks. This is why brick hitting videos need to be accelerated and frame dropped. Is that so? Now if you look back at the videos of those masters, you'll find that they all use this technique. This doesn't necessarily mean that all inch punches can't break bricks, right? It seems you don't know what kind of force it takes to break through three bricks side by side. Some netizens have tested that if you want to break three bricks side by side, even if you hit it with a hammer with all your might, it's hard to break, let alone barehanded. Even using a sniper rifle, you can only break three bricks. Is there anyone in the world whose fist is more powerful than a sniper rifle? Uh. Well. It's been a month since this incident. No other masters have been found to dare to challenge this 500,000 prize money. Now the Chinese internet is full of criticism of the inch punch. This incident has seriously damaged the reputation of Chinese Kung Fu. Because now the brick breaking on TikTok has formed a web celebrity industry chain. This incident may destroy the entire brick breaking industry, and a large number of web celebrity masters may be unemployed. It's better for these fraudsters to be unemployed, so that the real masters can stand out. Do you still believe that someone can break three bricks? Even if they can't break three, there should be masters who can break one brick, right? Even if he can really break a real brick, what's the use? Remember this sentence, boards don't hit back. What? <laughs> 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 <laughs>